production. Photography, copying of books and other materials is a modern technique that started at the beginning of the 20th century. Since then, photocopying has remained the most popular technique of document reproduction. It has been tremendous value to education and dissemination of information that today is commonly found in different places like libraries, information and documentation centers, archives, higher educational institutions, commercial enterprises, government and non-governmental organizations, and so on. In 1937, the process called serography was invented by American law student Chester Carlson. Carlson had invented the copying process based on electrostatic energy. Serography became commercially available in 1950 by the Xerox Corporation. Serography comes from the Greek word dry writing. Chester Carlson had been frustrated with the slow mimeograph machine and the cost of photography, and that led him to inventing a new way of copying. He invented an electrostatic process that reproduced words on a page in just minutes. Photocopying services are not designed to compete or replace duplicating processes, but to complement its services through direct reproduction of documents. Photocopying services are very useful in copying from materials that are suitable for direct reproduction. These materials include published materials like theses, dissertations, lecture notes, drawings, letters, and certificates to mention but a few. And the third one is the conceptual framework. Our input, photocopy errors per day. In the process, FE officers should organize programs like workshops, and seminars for operators of photocopy centers. The output, better service, less hassle for both staffs and clients. Second is the statement of the problem. This study is conducted to correlate the relationship between SARS copies produced per day and number of errors per day. We, we sought to find answers to the following questions. <clears throat> number one, what building has the most numbers of photocopying machines? Number two, what time of the day has the most highest photocopy activities. Number three, what kind of clients photocopies the most? Number four, how many photocopy errors are produced per day, each machine? Number five, how frequent does photocopy errors occur? Number six, what is the common cost of photocopy errors? I'm going to report about chapter two which are the definition of terms and the review of related literature and studies. Recography. The Encyclopedia of Librarianship defined recography as the art of producing single or multiple oh. copies of documents, whether by photographic or other means. According to the Focal Encyclopedia of Photography, define recography as a general applied to photographic techniques over producing flat originals such as documents, drawings, photographs, and printed matter. The International Encyclopedia of Information and Library Science stated that topography is an all-embracing term point in the early 1960s. According to Lahoud and Sullivan, define topography as a class of process whose purpose is to replicate by optical or photomechanical means previously created graphic or coded messages. According to Nana, define topography as in planned reproduction of two-dimensional visual communication media through photographic and non-photographic processes of image creation at very rapid but at low cost of the purpose of executing business and administrative operations. Photocopy Page 1966 defined photocopy as a copying by photography or quasi-photography and pseudo-photography. Similarly, Masson stated defined photography as a making of copies photographic process. The Webster's Third New International Dictionary of the English Language defined photocopy as a negative or positive photographic reproduction of graphic matter. Nana, Define photocopy as an adoption of photography whereby copies can be produced directly from the originals without need for recreation of the image, for instance, a master for subsequent reproduction. 
the New Webster's Dictionary of the English Language International Edition defined photocopy as a photographic reproduction of a document, illustration, and so on. According to Kyle, stated that one of the most important advantages of photocopying is that books are made more accessible to users without exposing the original to damage from overuse, vandalism, or death. Similarly, Amodeo stated that presence of photocopying machines in the library for photocopying purposes is to prevent the mutilation and death of books. Or stated the photocopying process has in recent years evolved to a point that is possible to choose archival quality copies using different copiers, provide the equipment is supplied with archival paper and staple. we use cluster or multi-stage sampling. This sampling technique is sometimes referred to as some area sampling because the population is spread out over a wide area. In our research, we surveyed the photocopying centers in different buildings within the, within the FEU area. Statistical treatment. We use SPSS or Statistical Package for Social Science to correlate the number of produced Xerox copies and number of errors per day per machine. The following pictures will, will show descriptive statistics and correlations. Level two tail. The magnitude or strength is moderate relationship. 